uh, which is the following is the most appropriate treatment option for this patient. Uh, GnRH agonist, Leverage-Stall, NSAID pills. Okay. A uh, 34-year-old woman with goes to her, presents her gynecologist with complaints of chronic pelvic pain, dysmenorrhea, sports pain worsens during menstruation, affecting quality of life. She has two kids, does not plan to have any more. Reveals pelvic tenderness in the pelvic region and nodularity in the cul-de-sac. Uh, transvaginal ultrasound is most significant. Patient diagnosed with endometriosis. Yeah, okay. They gave me endometriosis, which is nice. Um, which is following the most appropriate treatment option for endometriosis. Okay, let me think. So endometriosis is like a dysregulation of like LH, FSH. If you have like super high LH, so I assume like your hypopituitary, or like the pituitary gland, like axis or whatever, needs to be regulated. Um, so I don't think like NSAID, um, and on OCP will have estrogen and progesterone. IUD with progesterone and then you get rid of you I mean I don't know if she still wants kids or not you can either get rid of it all I don't know if that would take away all the pain like with the hysterectomy and that and then there's the GnRH agonist which would be luprolide and would help prevent uh, that stuff I mean my gut's telling me a um but I know that IUD and the pills like also have that hormone, but I'm just going to say, um, Hey, so, so interesting here, right? Complete, uh, the, uh, that given that the patient has completed her family and has chronic, uh, uh, pelvic pain, dysmenorrhea affecting her quality of life, the most definitive treatment for endometriosis in this case is total abdominal hysterectomy with bilateral, uh, um, salpingufurectomy, right? Sure. So you take, take everything out in this case right because she says that she has two children and does not plan on having any more yeah yeah does right. not plan on having more. yeah so that, that's the key difference here right they mentioned that so that you can be a little bit more aggressive in your management right but like you said right i think you have a good mindset of thinking okay so um if you control her hormones right then that's going to help decrease the flare-ups of endometriosis because endometriosis is just endometrial uh, tissue in the incorrect spots, right? That's practically what endometriosis is, right? So oral contraceptive pills, right? Um, also, you know, an IUD with the hormones, right? Also on top of that, right? Like, you know, a gonadotropin releasing hormone, all of those on a hormonal standpoint will help control kind of your symptoms and reduce that endometriosis by suppressing um, hormone that can cause that pain. And of course, NSAIDs is also part of the plan too, because it's symptomatically going to help with the inflammation, right? But right, the fact that they give you that she's completed her family, then you have to be thinking to your mind, okay, so if all these things can potentially help symptoms, right, what is going to definitively treat her the best, right? And taking out your, you know, ovaries, taking out your, um, your uterus, that's going to be very, very definitive. So